Okay, hey folks, now it's sitting next to me, Ken. Welcome. Thank you. Have you been nervous? Uh, I, not really. Not really. I'm okay. I'm a, little bit, I'm, a, I'm a little bit tired, but no, not nervous. Tired? Tired. Yeah. yeah? It's been a long Why? night. It's been a long night. Yeah, I was playing last night in Berlin, and uh, as what normally happens is it kind of goes into the early morning hours, and then I see daylight and sleep very little. And it's kind of, what, two o'clock in the day now, so. Where have you played last night? I played a, an Irish bar on Friedrichstraße called Oscar Wilde. Okay, it's normally for you to play uh, gigs in a bar? Mostly I play in bars, mostly, but um, I'll, I'll play anywhere. I'll play in gardens and in cafes and on the street and wherever, wherever. Also on the street, yeah? On the street, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. And what do you prefer to playing uh, in a bar or on the street? Um, well, it, the, the, the madness is the same. Um, whether it's the, in a bar or on the street, it, it, it can be as good and as bad. But um, I don't have a preference. If it's warm, I, I like to play on the street. When it's cold, nah, it doesn't work. So can tell us, uh, why do you wear um, nail polish? Uh, I like to draw attention to myself. Yeah. So if I didn't wear this, you wouldn't ask that question, you see. So <laughs> Why do you have such a small guitar? Um, it's just really handy for when I'm, when I'm, when I'm playing, because I play so much. I play probably every single day. So when, when I play my bigger guitars, they, um, I just end up kind of getting, like my body gets a little bit kind of, you know, pains and cramps and stuff. But no, it's really handy as well. Just really small on the back and you just carry it anywhere, you don't even feel it. Mm -hmm. It's perfect, yeah. Do you play other instruments except the guitar? Uh, I play other instruments very badly, but I, I, <laughs> I, I, try to, I try to. I play a little bit of, yeah, a little bit of anything. Piano, drums and yeah, I, I'll, I'll give anything a go. Okay. Yeah, but mainly, mainly guitar. I, I'm, I'm still learning how to play guitar as well. What's the name of the song you've performed in our studio? The song is called Last Glass of Wine. And what is it about? Um, I suppose it's about, it's about that time of night when you, you've kind of had enough. You've kind of had enough to, to, to drink. And, you know, someone offers you another one and you think, okay, should I or should I not? It could all go be kind of pear-shaped if you do. And, um, you know, mostly, most of the time you will. Well, I know I will. And uh, then it all goes haywire. But yeah, that's what that's what it's about. It's about to kind of knowing your limits, just just and the ability to say no. Where can your fans reach you? Um, I have a web, I have a, my own website. I have a Facebook and things like that. Yeah, that's that's the usual thing. But I just, to be honest, I just like to play, and and they can reach me by coming to see me play. Okay, that's and the best way for me. When people book you, so what can they expect? Um. For me, I'm, it's, I'm very passionate about the music I perform, so they can always, they can always be sure that it's, it's going to be, I, I'm going to be given everything I can in the night to, to entertain and to, to make it a good night. Yeah. What will it cost? What will it cost to, how much do you want to pay? <laughs> <laughs> well, no, I mean, you know, it, it, it really depends. It depends. It, sometimes it's, it's free, sometimes it's, well, thousands out of your songs you've you've written so what's your favorite my favorite song of my own um well i've i've written so i've, I've written so many songs and diff different songs have different different meanings and so i i don't i don't necessarily have one favorite mm -hmm. uh, certain songs can kind of remind me of a, of a certain thing or can mean a lot more to me than than others you know but i write songs all the time and There's no favorite, really. In the end, uh, is there something you want to say to your fans? So do this in this camp. Um, I suppose I just want to thank everybody for coming to the shows. Thank everybody for all the cool messages and all the cool questions that I always get. And um, I'm looking forward to playing the new album very soon, hopefully the end of November and playing some new songs and catching up again. That's really it. <laughs>